At St. James Brewery on Long Island, New York, Jamie Adams obsesses over his craft. Almost everything is done by hand and nearly every ingredient comes from local farms. Adams' obsession with local ingredients recently led him to an unexpected place. 130 feet underwater to the wreck of the SS Oregon. I recall quite clearly on one of my dives in 2015 having the idea that if I was able to recover uh, some intact bottles that we could certainly try to make uh, a new beer from those bottles. The SS Oregon sank off the coast of Long Island in 1886. Divers have been recovering artifacts from the ship for years, including bottles of beer. For most divers, the collector's items were the bottles themselves, but Adams wanted what was inside. The goal was to recover these bottles uh, purely for the yeast inside, and from there to start our project where we could recreate uh, what had been lost for over 135 years. After a winter storm unearthed a new section of the ship, Adams and a group of fellow divers were able to recover unopened bottles of beer. So our job was to really separate the good stuff from the bad stuff, which we did here with these petri dishes. So after successfully uh, and successively uh, moving from petri dish to petri dish along the lines, we finally came up with a pure uh, yeast strain. Adams took the 130-year-old strain of British ale yeast and began experimenting with new beers. The final product, aptly named Deep Ascent, made its world debut this past weekend. Knowing that it's from such a long time ago and kind of getting a taste of history, it's, it's exciting. Well, it's like drinking a piece of history. Adams says it's been amazing to share the beer with his fellow divers, and the whole project has reminded him what a great time it is to be a brewer. At that time in history, uh, uh, beer was important. It was important at that time, and it's great to start to see, in general, uh, craft beer becoming important again. Deep Ascent will be released locally this summer, and if successful, Adams hopes to distribute more widely by the end of the year. David Martin, The Associated Press, New York.